This is North Dakota Today. Good morning, good morning. Hi, everyone. Welcome right on into North Dakota Today. My name is Ashlyn Hill. And I'm Jillian Trudeau. Happy Thursday, everybody. Yes, we're almost there. We're inching our way toward the weekend. And what a big weekend for our region. Huge. Everybody a buzz because we are approaching the big FCS championship game in Frisco, Texas. Absolutely, and it looks like a lot of Bison fans are on their way now. Yes, if they're so not already, haven't left there. already, Yep. the trek is continuing. Yes, and maybe some people are just waiting for the weekend to go, so who yeah, knows. But, oh, uh, oh, 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 we're already well, on jumping it. right into it. Okay, <laughs> so of course, on the occasion, I had to throw it back yes. to this photo of yep. Jillian and I, which was at the very first Bison home opener tailgate at the Fargo Dome. So for me personally, my very first NDSU tailgate as I just moved here. And uh, we got together and, and went and had a ball. Yeah, no, that was so much fun. We went with a couple of friends and Some I think that was my first um, NDSU tailgate also. Oh, it was? Yeah. Okay, yeah, how so cute. that was fun. Well, so we've had live coverage, team coverage all morning, uh, you know, from Frisco, mm -hmm. from the stadium itself. And I was like, how did Jillian and I participate in this as well? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like digging through my phone for a little throwback, a little archive photo. And I thought, oh my gosh, look at us. That doesn't even feel like it was this year. No, honestly. Well, technically. Well, last year. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I know. Yeah. Weird. Yeah. No, it's funny because um, that was when I first started on the Valley Today yeah. also. So it's just like that transition from going into the mornings and yeah. then, yeah, becoming... You were just here, I know. just moved. And, and I yeah. love a good tailgate. I love a good tailgate, yeah, exactly. It's been so fun to get up here and to become part of Bison Nation and the fandom. I, it's like one of my favorite parts about up here. It's like everyone is so dedicated to oh this team. Gosh. And you saw me, I bought that hat, I bought the shirt. Yeah. I, I was like, anything <laughs> to support the team, I will look the part. Yeah, absolutely, and there were so many people there too. It's just like always, like all the students are always out there, all of the alumni are always out there. It's just very dedicated fans, and it's really fun to see that. It's it's great too with how creative people get on yeah. their lot space. Oh yeah. So the photo that we showed of us, behind us was like a VW Bug, all decked out in mm. green and yellow. Mm -hmm. It was like the Bison Mobile. And other people <laughs> like build pirate ships and like have yeah. like different things, and it's just really incredible to show how dedicated the fans are you know they park overnight they get ready so the fact that thousands of people are now making the trek south to Frisco I absolutely believe it it's oh, gonna yeah. be such a huge weekend oh my gosh so fun I did pull up the stats though because Jillian and I don't necessarily follow yeah. the game mm -hmm. but I did learn which I was kind of sad so NDSU is the number three seed and we're going against the number one seed SDSU mm -hmm. the game is this Sunday at 1 p.m. at Toyota Stadium in Frisco Texas and our boss just came in and said that the odds aren't in our favor I guess yeah. when it comes to statistics but I said no 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 we can do it <laughs> beginner's luck is what she said I did I said I'm bringing beginner's luck I'm new to Bison Nation and the fandom so I'm bringing that yep. for the team <laughs> I'll be the good luck charm yeah so. and hopefully that sunshine in Frisco will really pull uh, our luck there that weather yeah so we'll have more information from Valley today's or Valley News Live's Courtney mm -hmm. Lockie. She joined us on Valley today. We'll be keeping up with her throughout the week, but she also is going to give us an update here in our show this hour. Uh, but she's like in a sweater, and I was like, okay, ditch the winter jackets, everybody. You're heading south. Oh, that is so Break nice. Break out your I short can't. sleeve jerseys. Like, oh, that weather yeah, just sounds perfect. Short sleeve jersey. <laughs> <laughs> you know, your short sleeve corn cob <laughs> shirt. I don't know what you have. <laughs> short sleeves. I got mine from Walmart, by the way. I found out I was going to the tailgate and I went straight to Walmart and went straight to like all the team section. Oh, that's cute. where I got the hat, okay. that shirt, everything. And it was like relatively cheap, honestly. I mean, can't go wrong at Walmart. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. I didn't even think about going to Walmart. I would have yeah. just went to Shields. Oh, yeah, of course. They're, yeah. They'll get you decked out, too. Yeah, yeah true, You can't true. go wrong in this region. You Honestly, will, yeah. You could go to a gas station. Go to Casey's. They'll probably <laughs> have something. Huge. Yeah, I totally understand that. <laughs> I did find this out, too, you guys. I did not know this app existed, the Bison Tracker app on your smartphone. Yeah. I downloaded it literally in show this morning on my iPhone, and it truly shows you a grid of a map of green dots of where Bison fans are located on their actual trek to Frisco. Wow. And it formed an actual dark green line of fans. So people are already down there, more and more people making their way. Oh. I-29 had like a big cluster of dark green where people are physically driving and traveling. Oh. Like as that we speak, so cool. like in show right now. Yeah, and I was like, oh my gosh. 
gosh. So, so it's like real time. Yes. Wow. That is really, really cool. Yeah, there's about 4,000 people just under logged in as Bison fans. Holy cow. I know. I'm, I'm learning so many new. There we go. We even have a still of it. Yes. Okay. So up toward the top. Tippy top, that's North Dakota, Minnesota right there with all those green clusters. But you can see it really starts to form that thin line yeah. all the way down to Frisco. Well, that's incredible. Look at all those Bison fans going down to Frisco, Texas uh -huh. for the team. It's basically spring break. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the pregame spring break. <laughs> I know, I was checking Frisco uh, on the weather app and I was just like, yeah. oh, it's like 60 degrees or something like that. It's like, okay. Oh, welcome, yeah. welcome warmth. Oh, so, I wish. You know what's going to be funny? People in Texas are going to think everybody there in short sleeves or like just sweaters are absolutely Crazy. insane. Yeah. And they're going to be like, you can definitely tell who's not from Texas. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. At that stadium in particular in yeah. this one event. I It'll bet be you it's going to be wild, though. though. Yeah. I, businesses are going to be crazy. Mm -hmm. It's just going to be, I mean, I believe in Bison Nation. Oh, absolutely. We know some super fans. So. Wholeheartedly. We're going to win this. Yeah. <laughs> well, anyway, we have plenty more coming up other than just, you know, our good old NDSU. We have some wonderful guests on today. We have Shea West Garden Center, who actually has already set up this cute little boutique card over there. I don't know if we'll jump and take a live look at that. Oh, perfect. Look at it. We've got our working hard over there. And you guys, we're going to try something out new with John David today, mm -hmm. um, bringing out our creative side as always. But we actually hooked him up uh, on his iPad to our plasma television so you guys can follow along with a much more clear, bigger picture. So we're getting that set up as we speak as well. So hey, we're just, you know, got a lot going on, a lot of ins and outs this morning. Yeah, absolutely. But first, we're going to have your local steals and deals.